It's been two days since uh, the terrorist attacks uh, ripped through Brussels, and so far, three suspects have been identified, with another unknown suspect on the run. Reports of a fifth suspect are also emerging. As the manhunt continues, uncomfortable questions are being raised of the Belgian authorities on such horrendous terrorist attacks could have happened. Kwon Jang-ho has the latest. Belgian authorities are currently on the hunt for at least two men who were directly involved with the Tuesday bombings at a metro station and airport in Brussels. According to French and Belgian media, the first is a new suspect who was spotted on CCTV cameras accompanying the metro station bomber Khalid El Bakrawi just before the attack. The man has not yet been identified and it is not clear whether he was killed at the scene or is on the run. The second is a man seen at the airport with the two suicide bombers, one of whom who has been identified as Khalid's brother, Ibrahim Bakrawi. It is believed that this man fled the scene after his bomb failed to detonate. 31 people are confirmed to have been killed in the attack so far. An additional 61 people are in critical condition, four of whom are in a coma and haven't yet been identified, so authorities have only named a handful of the deceased victims so far. Identification has been difficult due to the damage done by the attacks and the number of foreigners among the victims. Foreigners still waiting to hear from missing loved ones have turned to social media and news outlets to try and find them. Meanwhile, the attacks have raised questions about what has been done or missed to prevent them. The three named suspects were known to have links to the Islamic State cell responsible for the Paris attacks in November last year. Ibrahim El Bakrawi had even been arrested and deported from Turkey in June, but the Belgian authorities did not extradite him as they felt there was no specific information linking him to terrorism. EU Interior and Justice Ministers will be holding an emergency meeting in Brussels on Thursday to discuss how to move forward. The only surviving suspect of the Paris attacks, Salah Abdeslam, was arrested in Brussels last week and was due in court for a hearing on Thursday, but it has now been postponed till April. According to his lawyer, he has denied any prior knowledge about Tuesday's attacks. He also added that the suspect does not oppose extradition back to France. Kwon Jang-ho, Arirang News.